That was not three euros worth of photos. Hello, beautiful. Uh, okay. Let's not talk about that. <laughs> yeah. We are at the Louvre. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to Paris. So if you haven't already guessed by the title and me saying, I am in Paris this weekend. I've come to see my friend Bridie. She's on a year abroad here, so I thought let's come and visit. So yes, today is Friday. I got here yesterday really late. Like my flight was delayed by about like an hour or something and then obviously getting to her. So yeah, I thought now's not really the time to intro the vlog, but I'm doing it now. So yes, I'm super excited. I'm here till Monday morning, so I've got a whole long weekend here and I'm gonna vlog. This is gonna be my first time getting out and about doing like a vlog of what I'm getting up to. This is not uni related for a change and yeah it's actually like outside the house really so I hope you enjoy. Let's have a good weekend in Paris. Stay tuned. And we are here in Paris. Hi. This is Friday. Bonjour. My bestie. <laughs> yeah she speaks French I don't. So yeah where are we? We're I in um, we're at Canal I think like it's Canal St. Martin, but if it, like, maybe like Canal San Martin or something. That's a canal, but yeah, we're here. The weather is a bit rubbish, but it's yeah. not raining, raining, so it's okay. It's just a bit like humid, it's not like drizzly and you know, too Yeah, down, it's so. not wet, we'll so <laughs> we will survive. But yeah, we're gonna go for a little mooch now. Outside a photo booth, like a street one, but we don't have enough change. Like, you can only use ones, twos, and fifties. So, we've got the two in there now. So, Bridie's like ran to a supermarket, like over the road to see if we can find one. But yeah, otherwise, I've lost two euros. <laughs> She's got one. So, yeah, we're going in here. It's literally on the street, a little photo booth. Oh, I don't want to damage it. Is it cute? Uh, it's uh, got a bit of a oh, look. Look. It's proper mu- look at that, that's it. That's that was not three euros worth of photo. That's literally got so many marks on it. What the hell? The one on your face there is- uh, that's so bad. Okay, so that didn't go to plan. Um, we already had money issues with that and now it literally is just printed very badly. So, oh well, for the memories, but it's that's not. very disappointing. Photo booth. You are bad. Just realised I haven't spoken to you in quite a while, so where are we now? We're in Montmartre and we're going to walk up to the back of the car. Right. I don't know what that is. <laughs> but <laughs> Yeah, uh, so we went for some food. We had quite a few problems with that because in Paris it seems everywhere shuts at three and then reopens at six. So when were we looking for food? Three o'clock. But we went to, where did we, we go? We went to uh, like Le Pain Quotidien. And I had like, soup yeah. and Bridie had like a curry and mine was quite nice. You weren't too keen on yours, were you? It, was, it wasn't good too much. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, so we had some food, obviously a bit later than anticipated, but we're, we're fed now, so we're fine. And now we're going to go where Bridie just said, where did you say? Okay. Well, yeah, we're like, going to oh, go there. The hill. Yeah, so we will take you there. Hello, my friend. Guys, we've come to like the most aesthetic it's tube stop, well, metro stop ever. Like, we just came and it's just, it's like all bronze, like. It's just very oh, funky, isn't it? Oh, that one's got a different one in that one. Yeah, we're very impressed with this. Bit sad to get hyped over, but it's a metro stop that's different to every other metro stop. Yeah, Bridie's friend sent her it and she wanted to find it and it yeah. just ended up here now. <laughs> Look at all this food. Look where we just went for food, guys. Isn't this the cutest place ever? They did pizza, which we enjoyed. It was, it was a good pizza. Now we're gonna go for drinks because we are <laughs> Sophisticated people are for cocktails or something, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cocktails because we're sophisticated. As always. Hopefully we find them, don't get lost. So yeah, it took us so long to find somewhere to eat because Hanks again massively let us down. They just don't seem to really exist or want to be open when we need them to be. So but I'm glad we went there. That was a good recommendation, Bridie. This is why I'm friends with Bridie. She's extremely good at knowing wherever we are across the world, 
This is our first place abroad together. Oh no, it's not! We went to Zanti together! Let's okay. not talk about that. <laughs> yeah, so this is why you're friends with Bridie. She does a lot of research and she just knows good places, good taste. Get yourself a Bridie. Oh, thanks for that. <laughs> That's a plug, Bad. guys. <laughs> It's not very in focus, but look what Bridie can see from her room. The Eiffel Tower. How cute is that? Good morning everyone, happy Saturday now. I didn't wrap up the vlog yesterday, did I? It's because I got back quite late, so yeah, sorry if you feel like I'm always kind of updating the morning after or something. But, what did we get up to? So we went for some cocktails, as I said, when we left the pizza place. And so we went to somewhere called Bisu, that was really nice. So basically up to 12 euros, which obviously sounds a bit pricey, but you are in Paris. But you kind of, it was like a made up cocktail. So um, I'll insert a picture now. But um, it was 12 euros and you kind of said what like alcohol you'd want and what like kind of taste you'd want. And they just brought you it. So it was really nice. And Bridie and I got two different ones that were both really nice. And then we went to somewhere called The Little Red Dawn, I think it's also called Away With Words. And that wasn't as good, if I'm honest, and it was quite expensive. Yeah, the cocktails weren't that great. I also had an alcohol-free one because I ran out of money, so um, I picked one and he was like, oh, that's alcohol-free, I was like, whatever. But yeah, it was also a bit weird, like, so it's like a little red door in the middle, and you think you're going to go through that and maybe down, but it really is just like a plain door like you just go through the side and then it's just kind of a normal bar so yeah that one was a tad disappointing but nevertheless it was a lovely night and then we just got back here and just went to bed really so today we are now going to head out it is it's around half 11 so we're going to head out now we're going to go and get some food and then we're going to just do quite a few tourist things today like see the eiffel tower and all that and also go to these gardens i think as well i think we're going to do that very soon so yes it is day two now i will try and vlog more in person today. It was quite hard in like the bars and the restaurants because like, it was really quite tight so I thought like I can't really hold this out anywhere and no one wants to see a below angle of me. But yes, so let's go with day two. Garden de Luxembourg, is that right? Yeah. That's right, so it's just like a big like gardens. Oh, it's really nice. It's huge. We didn't get the food in the end because um, we got like a pastry on the way, so that's kept us going for a little bit. But yeah, we're just gonna have a little walk around here. Where are we in the area? Um, so it's like the fifth arrondissement. They're all like in a style and all numbered. Um, it's like just on the side of the Latin Quarter. So. Yeah. Maybe, like, maybe like going to the Latin Quarter and explore there. Yeah. yeah, it's really nice though, like it's like, is it quite central as well or? Yeah, like if you were to look at a map of Paris and you like put the point in the middle, you kind of directly beneath Yeah, there. it's like a bit quieter than probably like the main central areas, but there's still loads here, like loads of cafes, loads of shops. It's dead nice. You probably also can't hear me right now because of the wind, but <laughs> you can. We are at the Pompidou Centre, um, we're going to go look around some galleries and the view is very nice as you've just seen, oh it's very whitewashed, but yeah I've actually done this as a research project in first year so I'm a bit triggered but it's a cool building so we're going to go to the, like the free galleries now and yeah and then where are we going after that? Uh, then we might go to the, the Marais and have a little wander and then just maybe the Louvre, the Tullerby Gardens, just some touristy things the tourist stuff in the tourist area today but it's nice we are at the Louvre we found it I mean we weren't looking for it Brian you knew where it was but we're here we're not going inside because the just, queue is yeah, massive. just don't want to either we're like it's nice it's such a nice area and yeah, and then we went to Pompidou, so I didn't film inside because yeah, but that was nice. And then we're we went. To... Looking, we? Yeah, exactly. We're just having a little look around, and then where did we go? 
59 River League, which is like a, like a former artist's mm. spot. So you can let people still work in artists in there, so you can just go in for free and quite nice. Yeah, it's quite like a studio. So yeah, it's quite nice. It wasn't really our taste, but it is quite nice to like go in. It's very different. It's not like a structured gallery. It's quite a studio. But I think the thing is it changes quite a lot as well. So I think if you if you go in this time, you go in another time. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, true. Because it's always like working, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. But yeah, but we're at the Louvre. I've always wanted to see it. It's very cliche Paris, but I've always wanted to see it. So. We are here and now we're going to head to... We're going to go to the Tuileries Gardens which is like just down there, like straight in front of the Louvre and then like just go to like the Grand Palais and like just, just some little... Yeah, nice cool. Thing. And then we were going to do the Eiffel Tower but we're going to see if we can get tickets to go tomorrow because we decided we actually want to go up it so yeah. if we can get tickets then we'll go up the Eiffel Tower because why not? So yeah, so as I said, we're not going up it and we'll try and go up it tomorrow but we just can have a little look at it. I mean, you can see it from Bridie's bedroom as well, which is bougie, bougie <laughs> Bridie over here. I'd have the Eiffel Tower as a bedroom window. But yeah, it's so cute, it's so nice to see in person. So now we're just going to make our way back to Bridie's. We're going to have food there tonight and then we're going to go out afterwards again. But yeah, so catch you in the evening. Hi guys, so um, sorry I look really like washed out, don't I? Um, it's actually like past one in the morning, so I'm sorry I haven't really vlogged, but it's because I went out with a couple of Bridie's friends, so while I had no issue with it, I didn't really want to like pull out my camera and start vlogging. Um, so basically we came back here and Bridie made us some food, which was really nice. And we just had a little chat and then we went out for a couple of drinks at this place. Not really intended to go, but it was really nice. And then we also got two pizzas to share between the four of us, which was really nice too. Like I didn't really intend to eat again, but it was really nice. So yeah, that's all I've done. So obviously I'll insert the picture of like our food now, but yeah. So as I said, it's really actually quite late. So I'm gonna now head to bed and then tomorrow is my last day. So hopefully it'll be a really good day again. I think the weather's due to be a bit worse tomorrow maybe some rain but it's fine if so we're gonna go to a park and just have a little chill around and get like a coffee then yeah just last day stuff you know but yeah i've had a really really good day it's been a busy day but i've had a really really good day so i hope you enjoyed my footage today very very good saturday and on with my last day tomorrow see you in the morning hello everyone happy sunday now and as I said last night, today is my last day in Paris, which is so sad, but I've still got the whole day. I don't fly back till tomorrow morning, so I've literally got the whole day, which I'm really looking forward to. So today we are going to go to this park, which Bridie really wants to take me to. She went the other week and she's like, I really want to take here, and it does look really nice. Like, I just love walking around a lot little parks and stuff, I think they're dead nice. Then we're gonna head back to somewhere which I can't remember, I think it's called La Marie. She literally just told me I can never remember names, which isn't very handy to put on YouTube, but yeah, I can't remember the name. And then we're gonna try and get to Chinatown as well, but if not, we'll see. We're just gonna take it chill, see what we get up to, just have a little mooch around again. Uh, we're not going up the Eiffel Tower anymore, which is a bit of a shame, but we looked at tickets and the tickets we sold out for certain things so we wouldn't really be getting a good value ticket so it is a bit of a shame I did want to go up however it's really nice to see from the outside anyway and I've seen the view from Paris from different things like Pompidou etc so yeah I'm really looking forward to today it's sad it's my last day but as I said I've got a whole day so I'm going to hopefully make the most of it we'll hopefully be out for quite a bit doing different things so yes let's have my last day in Paris woohoo There's so many runners. We're at Bouchemont. It's like a big park, as I said before, and it's dead cute. It's very autumnal. What a nice time to come. But yeah, when were you last here in summer? Or? <laughs> like two weeks ago. Oh. It's just so nice. I just thought it was a proper like, nice autumnal, yeah. like, October, November place to come. It's just chill. I mean, there is like ragged runners literally everywhere, but. It is a Sunday, I guess people are being fit. I just can't relate on that one. But yeah, Bridie's friend Lottie's coming to meet us now and we'll all just have a continued little mooch around. Just maybe grab a hot chocolate as well. Yeah, grab a hot drink, just chill out. It's such a nice park though. Okay, 
so I'm gonna kind of whisper because I'm in public, but um, we've come to the Modern Museum of Art and it's free, which is good. Um, we left the park because it started pouring down. So um, yeah, it was like really cold and really, really wet. Like it poured down. So then we went to this coffee shop, which I can't remember the name of, but I'll put it on the screen now. And that was really nice. I got like a coffee and some pancakes, which um, just like gave me, it like filled me up. So I'd only had like toast this morning and everything. So that was really nice. It was a really nice cafe. And then we've just got the Metro here now because obviously the weather's a bit like on and off. So we thought if we come here, then we're inside and it's free as I said, but yeah, so the weather has taken a bit of a turn today, but it is really nice here. So we're gonna have a mooch around the museum now of the modern art, so I'm excited. so nice in there in the museum I would definitely recommend that even if you're not that into modern art I would definitely go that is such a nice place in there um, really nice building and there's free there is bits you have to pay for but there is lots of free stuff as well so I'd definitely go there okay so now we're gonna go back to Notre Dame area just have a little walk around then we're undecided on food I think we might just go back to Bridie's to save some pennies but we might eat out we'll see but yeah, we're just gonna have another little walk around, which I know is all I've like done on this trip. But yeah, we're in a nice area now. I can't remember the name again. I'm so bad, imagine vlogging and not knowing where you are. But yeah, no, it's dead nice here. We've got these nice buildings in the background. But yeah, so I'm um, gonna head back to Notre Dame area now, have a little look around, see if anything interests us. Yes, so just another little walk around, but definitely recommend the Museum of Modern Art if you're in Paris, really good place. <laughs> Change of plan, we're gonna go for dinner here. We're all hungry and it's my last night so we're gonna eat here, it's called Cafe J. Evening everyone, so for a change, it's actually not even nine o'clock yet so I'm not actually ending my vlog of the day at like one in the morning or I'm not vlogging at all because it's too late. But I am gonna stop vlogging for the night. So we went for food, as you've just seen. That was a really nice food. I got a burger. I haven't really eaten, I haven't eaten any French apart from like this pastry on this trip. But the food's been great regardless. So yeah, I had a burger. That was really nice. And then we just made our way back actually. So we were gonna go and like look at the Eiffel Tower from a bridge or something. But um, I've got a park and like everyone's quite tired and stuff. So we've decided not to. Like I've seen it quite a few times walking about and now you can actually see it from Bridie's window which is nice as well. My flight is early in the morning so um, I'm gonna go and pack because I don't have time to pack in the morning, just pack now, everything's done, get up and go and yes I will get back home, well to Huddersfield and I will end it there because the stuff I want to say and I want to make sure I get it all in so see you tomorrow. Hi everyone and welcome back to my bedroom, no longer in Paris sadly and yet back in sunny Huddersfield and going to wrap up the vlog now. I just wanted to do it at home just so make sure I was wide awake to actually make sure I say everything I want to say. But yes, I am back now and just want to say thanks so much for watching. That was my first out and about vlog, getting my camera out in public and it was difficult, like it, it can be quite uncomfortable but I've done it and if I'm on any other trips I'll definitely do that again. But yeah, back now, just want to say thanks so much to Bridie if you're watching, I've had the best weekend ever and it was so nice to see you and thanks to everyone who's watched it if you've made it to the end and you just watched my videos or if this is your first one thanks for watching this too hit the subscribe button everyone i do upload weekly i know i fell off my schedule last week but that's because i didn't really do anything and i don't want to upload rubbish content but back to every friday it's definitely something i'm going to stick to and maybe in the new year might even be able to upload it twice a week or something but we'll cross that bridge when we get to it but yeah, if you want to follow me on Instagram, it is you and Ross underscore if you want to see more content. And as I said, thanks so much for watching. I had the best weekend and sad it's over. But back to university vlogs. See you next Friday, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe. <laughs>